Hello everyone, I'm Carly and thank you so much for joining me on another episode of Crafting with Class. Today I have the unboxing and my honest impression of the Anna Griffin Create 7. So you will see me, and I'm so sorry because this is a super long video, but I'm, you're going to get exactly my honest opinion and what I feel about this kit. So how about we get started? Hello everyone, I'm here for the unboxing and my honest impressions of the Anna Griffin Create 7. Um, so as I mentioned in my last video, um, I went ahead and signed up. This is the first time that I attend um, Anna Griffin Create. Of course, I've known about it for as long as she's been doing it and it was always something I aspired to attend. Um, this year has been very um, <laughs> challenging um, and so I felt like I just really needed to do something for me and really treat myself to something, um, you know, because it, it has been, has been brutal. So um, that's what I did. And so I'm super excited and so I'm going to share the unboxing with you and what I think about it. And let's open up the box. This is box one of two. Um, beautiful. Purple is my favorite color, so we're already good. So, um, as I mentioned, I haven't opened anything. Um, I like to unpackage things before I share them with you guys, but um, I haven't done that. So, you get a lovely welcome letter. And, um, ooh, nice itinerary of events. Um, and, it, ooh, nice little pin. All right. Oh, pretty, pretty, pretty. All right. So there's those contents. And I'm, I'm here for this purple. It's so pretty. All right, this is class one. It says flip to be square. So these come on these poly envelopes. These are nice because they'll be nice for other things too. All right, take that off. Oh, they have their logo on here. That's nice. Okay, let's see what's, whoops, what's in here. I, yep, I missed that. So you have these little tags. Um, I'm going to try to go through these a little bit quickly. Just so this isn't like an hour long video. Okay, so you have all these little tags, um, all occasion, it looks like, with foil. Very nice. I can always use those. I feel like I need to sort this before the event just so that I'm not fumbling and looking for things. Um, and if you've gone, if you or you're going to go, and if you have any tips for a newbie like me <laughs> that you think would be helpful, Please, please, please. Would you mind sharing that in the comments? All right, this is matte foil cardstock in pink and in gold, and you can never have too much of this, especially gold. This pink is really pretty too. All right, and these are six by six squares, I think. Those are pretty. And then the dies. Oh, these are so pretty. These are so pretty. So. This, I take it as one of those that when you open it, like this part flips to the other side. Oh, that's so pretty. Um, oh, okay. Oh, wow, this is gorgeous. Sorry if it's very noisy. All right, so that's what they look like. Oh, these are stunning. These are beautiful. And it's nice because I think she's offering these outside of the event. So if you were just to purchase them, at least you have the directions. Oh, these flowers. I remember this from um, that teacup kit and I love them. So are these stickers or are they just paper? Ooh, I think are these stickers. Let's see, let's see. And, oh yes, friends, they are stickers. Oh, oh, we're starting off, we're starting off great. So, yes. And that's a nice amount, too. 
Okay, and then you have these um, little round panels. Okay, all right, let's go on to the papers. Oh, these are super pretty. These seem really long. Let me see. These are more than 12 inches. They seem longer, but they're 12 inches by uh, 7 and 3 fourths. All right, so let's see. And they're double sided. So I'll just fan these out a little bit greens and purples and pinks and blues and her ivory so those are nice patterns and then florals on the other side and then that basket weave kind of pattern oh that's pretty all right so these are going to be beautiful okay so that is class number one and these dies are stunning okay so there's that Class number two is called Fantastic Photo Cards. Ooh, I've, I don't think I've ever done photo cards, have I? I can't remember. But guess who will be doing them this year? <laughs> so I'm going to have to make my kids take pictures with me. So that's lovely. So I think this is an easel one if I remember. Yeah, there it is. Let me open this up. I know this one is being offered already outside of the event. And I think that's I think that's great because um, you know, if you can't go, at least you can have, you know, the goodies. Yeah, these are so nice. All right, so there, and you can do them either vertically or horizontal. Nice, nice, nice. Lovely. Okay. And next, let's take out the embellishments first. So you get some more flowers. Okay. okay, so these are also, ooh, these are pretty. Foil stamped. These are more Christmas oriented. Um, I think these might be, are these not stickers? Oh. Oh, yes, they are. They are stickers. Yay. Okay. And then you have some, ooh, these are nice because they're like, they have dimension already and these are stickers, I can tell. These are all Christmas themed from what it looks like. So, yeah, Merry Christmas and enjoy. So yeah, these are, these are very pretty. I like the size of these. Sending love and warm wishes. That's nice. All right. So those are the sentiment ones. And then you get more flowers. I guess in case you don't really want to do Christmassy stuff for your photos. Ooh, look at these beautiful flowers. And then the little swirls. I like these. And then you get more banners. Oh. And these are bigger than the ones from before. And then these are all occasion. So where the other ones were, this is birthday, warm wishes, especially for you. So these are dimensional also. That's nice. You have those two options, so more Christmassy options with these two, and then all occasion with these two. So I guess you can make that choice when you're making it. That is awesome. All right, we have um, these five by seven envelopes. They look really big. No, this is eight and a quarter by five and a half. So I guess it is for five by seven. You have a lot of space there. You get more foil card stock, which I am not complaining. It's, it's expensive paper, and so the more the merrier. Ooh, oh, look at that. It's beautiful. I don't know. That's lilac or like purpley, and you get purple, red, green, and then this blue, and then this is kind of like a rose. So look at those colors. Beautiful. That's a lot. That is a lot. Very good. 
mama like all right and then the papers and these are all cardstock papers by the way i don't know i think i mentioned it but they're cardstock so they're not the layering like weight and so let me fan these out so those there 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 and there okay so these are the patterns on this side am i missing one yes okay so these are the patterns on this side and these are the patterns on the other side very nice very nice all right so that is class number two festive photo cards so far honestly a plus very good moving along okay next is class three all boxed in so let's untangle this or unravel it all right let's see Ooh. let's grab the embellishments first Ooh, this is a lot of embellishments and ribbons and get ribbons in like that ivory in a really pretty like blue all right so you get some signature cards i think they're called in like christmasy colors and these are uh, gold foiled you get some embellishments and these are all gold and ivory embellishments so you have some tea cup not tea cups teapots a serving tray some flourishes okay I don't tend to use these very much but you know what maybe I'll learn how to incorporate them a little better than I do and then these are the same type but gold and ivory but these are more Christmassy you have holly there lots of different types of holly and then some more swirlies all right you have some more of these um, titles and these says happy birthday happy Christmas sending holiday cheer for my friends so they're kind of mixed Christmas and all occasion and they're in the smaller side which I like because sometimes it's nice to be able to embellish more in just a smaller sentiment and then you have two bags of embellishments so one of them you have more Christmassy type that's a nice amount too these are 3d the others were not but these are 3d and that you have two layers and you know me i'm i tend to be cheapy <laughs> so i will just pull back and take the um adhesive foam tape off from the bottom and then have two <laughs> so i don't always do that but sometimes you know i do but you have holly leaves in here, some Christmas roses. Those are pretty. These are really nice. Yeah. All right. Those are very pretty. These would even look really, really pretty on those photo frame ones. Um, and then you have more all occasion flowers. These are nice too. Oh, I love these. These are three dimensional also. Um, love 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 these i have i have these already i think these um either from the china cabinet or the other one i can't remember but love these oh my goodness these dies wait what is this class called again um all boxed in okay so i guess this makes a box it's a big box that's very long so and then I love these and I love these too. Ooh, this is nice. You know what? Let me open this so I can take a look. At what this will be. Oh, kind of like a wallet. So it's a card and then has a pocket built in. Okay. Mm-hmm. 
Oh, there's some more dies in there. Ooh, I like that holly border. Okay. Yeah, this is kind of like a pocket card box. <laughs> all right. All boxed in. Oh, okay. Nice. I don't think this is something you could mail, though. It looks like it's two-dimensional, like too boxy. Not like something that you would be able to mail. You'd have to put it in something to mail it, I think. But it would be nice if you're hand giving something, you know, where you can tuck in. You can tuck that in. And oh, look, more, more foil cardstock. And these are all in gold, which is great because that's the color I tend to gravitate to. And then the papers. These are 12 by 12. Okay. So let's fan these out. Look at these colors. Oh my goodness, they're so pretty. All right. Mm. All right, so here's what the fronts look like. All right, so you have red, green, blue, pink, white, or ivory with green, and then ivory with red. Look at how pretty these are. All of them have gold, gold foil stamping, beautiful. And then here's the backs. Oh, look at these. Oh, so pretty. Great patterns. I mean, there's beautiful because if it's something double-sided, both sides will be lovely. All right. Okay, so that's class number three. I'm excited. Oh, my gosh. Wow. You know, right now, I'm super excited. I don't feel like, meh. I'm so far, honestly, these are all awesome. These are beautiful. Cannot wait. Class four. I think there are six classes, so that's this is a lot. I mean, yes, it costs a lot, but you get a ton. So ornamental, what is this called? Ornamental pieces. Class four. Alright, so I know these are also available. Uh, on their own so you get three I believe if I remember three ornament dies so the house die and angel die and one more but let's find out happy Christmas ornament dies yes so you get three the angel the ornament is this like a balloon maybe and then the little house Cute, cute, cute. Oh yeah, it's a basket, a balloon with a little basket. But if you wanted to just have the ornament, you don't have to attach the bottom, I don't think. Cute. Cute, cute. All right, so. I don't think I took out the other. Oh, okay, I see. Okay, nice. I, you know, the thing I like about Anna Griffin dies is that there's always something extra, you know, like the little decorative elements always make them just a little extra, you know, in a good way, though. All right, next. Uh oh, glitter. Mm, I don't, I'm not a fan of loose glitter. <laughs> I may have to do an alternative. This is gold cord, little gold cording. Oh, probably for the little. Um, to hang the ornaments. This is glitter in two colors. So a gold glitter and a kind of more of a rose gold. This is actually a pretty, pretty color right here, but I'm not a fan of loose glitter. So we'll see what they use it on and if I play along. <laughs> All right. All right. And then you have more foil paper, or foil card stuff. This is a nice long. I think this might be 12 inches long. And you have red, gold, and then that really pretty blue. Oh, I'm feeling this blue. So pretty. All right, that's lovely. Next in here, what is this? 
oh, vellum. I'm like, <laughs> all right. Yes, I think these are vellum sheets. Yes. Oh, these are nice. Is that just one? Oh, yeah, these are nice heavyweight vellum. Vellum cardstock, I would say. Okay, you get a few sheets of that. And now, le papier. The paper. All right, so you get... Let's fan them out. That one, that one, that one. This pretty green. Ooh, oh, oh I, I love that. Oh, and it's in two colors. Oh, yes. I'm here for this. Look at this beautiful paper. All goil, all goil, goil. <laughs> all gold foil. I'm sorry. I can't speak. I'm... I've literally been left like speechless here. So beautiful patterns, all gold foil. And then on the back are the more tone on tone. Oh, look at this. It's like a little tiny bricks, little tiny bricks. Can you see that? Nice. And then little, little tiny snowflakes. Love, beautiful, beautiful, love it. Okay, so that was class or the ornamental pieces, the ornament dies. Okay, let's put that in there. All right, so let's put that in there. So those are four right there. So there's two and one. Oh my goodness. All right. Let's go ahead and grab the second box because, oh yes, friends, there are two boxes like this. Ugh. Okay, let's grab this one. So it's the same size box. This one feels a little heavier. Let's see. Let's turn it around. All right, this is class five and six. I guess they're combining these two. This is called Explosion, let's see, Explosion Box House. Oh, okay. All right, let's open it up. Let's take out all the embellishments first. Mmm. Okay. Let's see. All right, so you get these flowers. Let's open this up because it looks like there's different things in here. Okay, so you have some ivory. Oh, I know these butterflies. I like these. Look at how sweet. Okay, so you have some ivory and gold embellishments in little butterflies, floral, swirlies, a heart, a cake. Those are nice. I don't know where they come from because I don't have these particular ones. And then you get more florals. And these are not stickers. These are one dimensional and they're like cardstock. That's a nice variety there. All right, next you have these little tiny tags. And these are like white. No, they're white on the back, they're ivory. Ivory on the front, look at how cute. A little, literally a little note to say. And then, so these are all occasions also. So you have little tags, some squares and some circles, all occasion, those are super cute. And then, hmm, oh, okay, they've already die cut some pieces for you. Um, so you have fences, windows, doors, is it? Yes. Oh, okay. So these must be, I don't know. So <laughs> we'll find out. They're, they're for decorating, of course, but I don't know how that goes. And then you have more foil cardstock. 
And are these all gold? Yes. So these are all gold foil cardstock. Like I said, can't get enough of that. And then, hmm. These um, are already printed and scored. Look like little houses. So let me take those out. To get several of those. And I don't want anything. Several of those. Oh. Ooh, now I'm excited because I cannot wait to see what we do with these. These are cute. I like the colors. Little taupe. All right. Uh-oh. I already tore that bag. All right, then the dies. Let's see, explosion box dies, but this said explosion box house. Oh, maybe because it's two classes, so it's two different things. All right, let's take a look at this. I think this one is also available on its own. Oh, this is pretty. Um, let me take this out. Okay. So explosion boxes, I'm very familiar with. Those are not terribly hard, but I'm sure she's going to make them amazing. Mm. Okay. You can see what it will look like. Okay. Oh, wow. There's the lid. I'm sure that's the lid. And this looks like the base. That's very pretty, all on its own. And then the layering parts. Look at this bow. That's very pretty. Hmm. But it has little tabs here, but it looks one-dimensional, so... Hmm. All right. Let's put these back in here. Some back in here. Put it in here. Yes, I'm feeling like I'm gonna need to like prep this a little bit. I don't think I can have it just like this and be able to go. I feel like I need to have things separated a little bit. All right, and then the paper. Okay, so let me fan these out. Mm, oh, this gray is so pretty. This black is striking. And then there's ivory. And then that taupe. Look how pretty. That's just a beautiful palette right there. Now, these don't have any gold foil. They're just matte printed. But look at how pretty. And then the back is also matte. There's no gold. And then... You can see all the different tone on tone ish. Very nice. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. All right. So there's that one. I'm very curious to see what happens with those because I didn't see anything in the instructions per se. So let's get everything in here. All right. Let's go on to class six, seven, five, six, six, seven. Hmm. Interesting. Wow, there's just a lot in this. There is a lot. I will say that much. It's it's costly, but you do get a lot. Okay, so what is this? <laughs> um ribbon bound journal. Okay. Ribbon Bound Journal. Oh yes, I remember this. I'm not really a book, well no, that's not true. I am a total book person, but I don't tend to make my own like journals and things. I just buy, buy them. But I think for something special, like a gratitude journal maybe. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. 
I think I am going to make myself a gratitude journal. Ooh, this is pretty. Ooh, ooh, that looks complicated. <laughs> I think I'm going to need to pay extra attention during this part because I'm not really a stitcher. Um, all right, let's look at these guys. This is the spine. I can get it out. Ooh, that is that is beautiful. That's so intricate. I don't know how 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 she does this, but she does it every time. And then you have this is the book. Wow, let me see what the size of the finished book will be. Approximately five and a half by seven. So about a five and a half by seven book-ish by the time you're done with it. Not counting the spine, just that. That's a nice size. It's not all teeny tiny. Oh my gosh, look at that bookmark. Oh, I need one of those. And then the little pocket. That corner die is spectacular. Look at this. I don't know what this is for, but I'm sure it'll be important. <laughs> Oh, woo I'm not excited. All right. Okay, so there's that. Let me put this back in here. Yeah, I'm going to make, when I'm making this, I'm going to try to make this extra special. Like, really, really do it well because I am definitely gonna make myself a gratitude journal. You know, sometimes when you're in the midst of something, being grateful helps you to see things a little differently even when it's not going great. All right, wow, you get a ton of flowers in this one. Okay, you have the, oh, that's pretty. Okay, the cording for the book. Now looking at the holes, where I'm assuming you're going to thread this through. This seems pretty thick. So um, that might be a challenge already. You're setting me up to fail, Anna. No, well, we'll figure it. We'll do it. We'll do it. All right. And then you have some blank signature cards. And then um, some more. These are not dimensional. But they look like they're all occasion. The ones that are printed, at least. Precious and fewer friends like you. Friends are like pretty flowers. They bring color into the world. Oh, these are like the basket ones. Are these the only ones that have sentiments? Oh, no, there's some more. Okay. Oh, but you get a ton of them. That's nice. All right. Then you get some more. Ooh, butterflies. Are these all butterflies? I hope so. <laughs> Look, all butterflies. Nice, nice. Because if I'm putting flowers on something, you know I'm going to be attaching a butterfly. Great, great. All right, let's take a look at the next. Now, this is a lot. This is a hefty bag. Oh, these are big, too. Oh, these are pretty. And they're dimensional, which you know what that means. Two fur. Oh, these are pretty. Oh, no. It's only a partial twofer. <laughs> you got me. You got me. Because, see, only this layer has um, two. And then this one only has one. But, are they, yes, they're stickers. That's pretty because I like those two levels of dimension. So, I may keep them as this. And so, there's lots of... Ooh, look at these. I mean, the purple, you know, right away. <gasps> Look at that's pretty. Hmm. I don't have these flowers. These are pretty. All right, so you get a lot of them. So, yay. Yay. All right, so there. And then you get another bag. Now, this one has other things besides flowers in there. Let's take a look. Okay, so this one has more flowers. 
Oh, roses, my favorite. That and orchids. Anna, please make an orchid, like an orchid um, sticker theme, please. I know you would do it amazing. And then you have, oh, look at that birdie. And then you have more butterflies. Love, 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 love. And then you have, let me see, let me try to get these. Oh, you have little, look like little postcards. Or they look like, you know, like the fronts of seed packets. How cute. Oh, wow, there's even more. And then, yeah, these totally look like postcards. These are so pretty. And they're blank on the other side. Hmm. It'll be interesting to see how we are supposed to use these. All right, so that's a lot of embellishments right there. Look at these butterflies, how pretty. All right, so there's class six and seven of Ribbon Bound Journal. This one will be awesome. I cannot wait for this class because now I'm excited about making myself a gratitude journal. I really feel I need one. And here we go. Oh, and actually, we're not done because I haven't taken out the other things. <laughs> I'm telling you, yeah, this is a lot. So you get envelopes. No, you don't. They're not envelopes. Silly. These are the inserts. And they're blank. Oh, duh. These are the, I'm sure, these have to be the um, the inserts for the, for the book, right? The pages inside. I forgot this is a book and not a, I'm like, why didn't you put any sentiments in there? No, no, it's the insert for the book. And then these are gold foil, um, cardstock. And just want to make sure they're all gold. Yep, this is all gold. Yay. And ooh, look at that's a lot of paper. That is a lot of paper. All right, let's take a look at this. Ooh, I already love this. Tone on tone roses on pink. Yes, please. Okay, let's do this one. This one. And this one. Alright, so these are pretty muted. This one is just um ivory. So there's those. This one's pretty. Alright. So there they are. There's no gold foil, just matte. And then this side. You have these patterns. Okay, nice. These seem like they're a little older, like a little older from maybe other collections in the past. That's what the vibe I get. Okay, that's that. Wow, that is a lot of stuff. This, it's almost, I don't want to say it's overwhelming, but it's a little bit, but in a good way. You know, like, because now I am looking so super forward to how all of this is going to happen in three days. Like, wow. Okay. All right. That was the last, <laughs> the last class one. And now this is swag. So I guess these are all the extras on top of all the stuff you get all right bows i see bows so bows in purple blue pink green these are a nice size too they're not all clunky big ones all right and then you get um double-sided tape this is not foam tape just like score tape like that and then you get, wow, you get a lot of little itty bitty foam squares. These are tiny. Mm, I don't know that I'll be using these per se. I can't even imagine trying to get them off. Oh, there's different sizes. Oh, yeah. Okay. So two of these super itty bitties. And you get two. These are weird. Okay, two of those medium-ish, and then two of the large. So itty bitty, medium, and large. These feel weird. Like, I don't know. All right. And they're 
the dimension actually is not too bad. I like the, the size. They're not super, super bulky. All right, and then you get, oh, wow, more gold foil cardstock. Yes. Oh, I'm not going to have to buy gold foil car stock for a while. Look at these colors. These are like jewel tones. Well, this one is. <laughs> so that's like a fuchsia. This is like a champagne, a lavenderish. That blue and then rose gold. Oh, yes. Oh, beautiful. Like spring. Yes, I'm here for this. Yep, this is just pretty, 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 pretty. I mean, it's amazing because all of the packages come with foil already, and then you get more. Yay! And you get more! Let's see these. Okay, oh, that green is like... Yes, these are like more traditional Christmas colors because you have your, what is this? Like either silver or like a blue. I can't tell. I think it's silver. <laughs> silver, you get red, you get gold, you get, oh yeah, yeah. This is definitely a, like a bluish silver, your traditional matte silver, and then green. Let's see. Pretty, 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 pretty. And all of these, I believe, are five by seven. Nope, they're five and three quarters by seven and three quarters. Okay, and you get, wow, even more. <laughs> okay, like, stop the madness. What is this? Like, this is stunning. Look at all the different, it's like that, dio, what is that called? Diochrome nail polish that shifts. Okay, like, does she sell this? And why haven't I not gotten some of this? Duochrome, that's what I want to say, duochrome. Do you see how it shifts? Blues and purples and pinks. That is stunning. Okay, wow, wow. Okay, this is stunning. I know, I'm, like, still here. <laughs> then you have pink, that's a pretty, like, peachy pink. And then you have ivory and then you have gold and did i mention this like oh my gosh this is stunning now i'm gonna oh yes oh wow that is gorgeous that is gorgeous i think if all of them would have been like this duochrome i would have had a heart attack right here <laughs> that's beautiful all right more and these by the way are shimmer so they're not glitter and they're not matte and they're not shiny they're like shimmery but not glittery if that makes sense <laughs> all right this one is another like shimmer see how it shimmers this is beautiful green like an emerald like a really nice solid green this is like um, ivory-ish, beautiful, almost like it has a little green tint to it next to this one, kind of like a sage, I would say. This is like sage, and then gold and red. Look at these, they're stunning, beautiful. Ah, love it. <sighs> oh, friends. Mm. get the envelopes for those folded I'm assuming yes okay how many of those do you get one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve so a dozen of those all right look at all the pretty papers this is why this one felt heavier <laughs> because it has all these papers wow more and there's still more we 
got to the bottom. Okay, let's do the last, the last one. And if you have stuck around, thank you. I hope you're excited to see this. Um, and if you are going, let me know what you're looking forward to doing first. And if you're not going this year, maybe, you know, it'll happen for you. You just have to, you know, you need to save for something like this. You definitely need to save, but make it something that you do because, wow, these are 3D. Little tags and circles and rectangles and long rectangles. And these look like they are all occasion and some Christmas. Very nice. And look, there's a lot of them. All right. And then you get even more. Oh, these are so pretty. These are the smaller size ones. I think these might be from the China cabinet ones. I did buy those. Oh, yeah. And they're the three-dimensional ones. So pretty. Love these. I love these. And then you get envelopes. Nope. Nope. Not envelopes. Card bases. So these are five by seven card bases. Five by seven card bases. I'm running out of space here. And then you have five by seven envelopes. And then you have, what is this? Vellum? Yes, this is heavyweight cardstock vellum in different colors. Interesting. So you have a nice deep red. But see how it's like semi-transparent? You can kind of see my fingers back there. So it's not like, it's like, it's not like really thin, thin vellum. It's pretty heavyweight vellum. Nice. So red. You have a green. You have a burgundy, then ice blue, and am I missing any? Green, like this is more of a Christmas green, and then more burgundy. And I think it repeats, yeah. And then gold, I think, at the back? Yes. Or is it olive? <laughs> well, something like that. All right, so you get those, and then you get some more. And these are just the same colors, but they look a little more muted. A little more pastel-y. Not really pastel, but just more muted. Ooh, pretty. Yeah, it looks like this similar color, see? But like the darker version, the lighter version of the same hue. All right, friends, that is the end. What do you think? Do you think this is worth the money? I think so. I do, actually. I mean, it's a lot of money, but you get so much. Really, she really hooks you up. I do have to say that. And um, again, if you're going, please let me know what you're looking forward to doing, um, which which project really stands out for you. And if um, you're watching, then and you want to go, you know, keep working toward it. Um, you know, I was there for six years watching from you know from afar. <laughs> And, you know, I'm going this year. So it's something that can, it can happen. If it can happen for me, it can happen for you. So, all right. Now I'm going to get this organized. I can't even fit it back into the box. But, you know, that's a good problem to have. All right. Thank you so much if you have watched this far. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.